So the other day, I asked on the community tab, want a chance to be featured in an upcoming video? Who do you think is in the chamber? Wrong answers only. Because obviously, like I've already alluded to and said in a lot of previous videos that I definitely believe that this is where Cell will be emerging from and making some kind of debut, whether it's the original, probably not, or an much likely a brand new cell. I figured let's have some fun with this and see what you guys <laughs> could see. And honestly, this is basically a very uh, shits and giggles video. So let's get into it. So first up, we have, it could be that the chamber is an energy collector being used by the RRA, the Red Ribbon Army, to make artificial dragon balls. Little do they know, one of their scientists has other plans for it. You know, for a wrong answer only kind of situation, I'd kind of expect people to really, you know, be bizarre. And I'm sure there are going to be some bizarre answers, but this kind of seems more like a practical answer rather than a wrong answer only. But like I said, that does seem kind of uh, legit but moving on to the next one come on we all know it's gonna be john cena and his name is john cena now that's what i'm talking about but what do you mean he's in the movie you just sell just bring him back already damn it that's 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 the right answer what what shredder that's the techno drum <laughs> <laughs> yo, that kind of does look like the techno drone. Low key, holy shit, yo! Imagine, definitely hits clone. Mmm. Okay, yeah, definitely got to be hit. Hits clone rather. I'm not even gonna lie, I totally forgot about hit. Like, I mean, he's universe six and everything, but yeah, I just totally forgot about hit. I'm pretty sure he's more involved in Super Dragon Ball Heroes than he is and or has been in Dragon Ball Super. Super Saiyan three Nappa, it has to be. Funny thing is, the first thing I think of when I when I see that comment is Super Saiyan three Nappa. I think maybe exists in Super Dragon Ball Heroes, or maybe I just saw some kind of fan art where it's literally just him with gold eyebrows and like a super long gold beard, which makes a lot of sense because he is bald, but he did have hair before. So I mean, why can't the man grow some hair, like sprout some hair and maybe give emphasis on the long beard? I don't know, whatever. It's got to be selling his perfect form because remember the Red Ribbon Army created him. That's a right answer. Next, Xeno Goku after he just fused with Goku. I mean, isn't it obvious? It's gotta be Arceus because they didn't add him in Diamond and Pearl. Oh, right, right. Yeah, because, you know, they didn't add him in a Pokemon game. So they naturally just had to bring him over to a completely different realm in Dragon Ball. Yeah, you're on to something. Dr. Jiro, think, oh, the irony. Yo, that would be ridiculous. But I don't think they'd be freaking out that much if it really was just, you know, Dr. Jerome. Why the hell would they freaking have a humongous technodrome looking ass thing for little old Dr. Jerome? Either way, it's a fair answer. El Hermano de Jiren, aka Jiren's brother. Okay, well, sure. It's the YouTube ad revenue. Ha! That's a really good one, because boy, I sure can't relate to that. Elmo? <laughs> How the fuck did Elmo get in there? That's crazy. Get that, get that poor guy out of there. Super Saiyan 5 Gogeta. So they managed to somehow get Goku and Vegeta in the Technodrome and they fused and somehow were able to skip 4, just go straight to Super Saiyan 5 and that's why that shit's going crazy. Yep, fair answer. Obviously Raditz. Obviously. Mewtwo. Damn. I'm so used to seeing Mewtwo in like, you know, tubes that you can see him in there. Having him in this, I mean, damn, that's OD. He's, he's gotta be like Mew 3 or something like that. Bio Broly. This is probably gonna be one of my favorite answers, and I'm gonna lie, just because of how perfectly terrible that is. But for this video's sake, that's that's an amazing answer because fuck Bio Broly number one. Let's just not forget that freaking character could have been way better, way cooler. No pun intended. But they decided to freaking make him a huge sludge thing with four pieces of freaking hair. This is not a bio broly rant, but come on man. They did my they did my man broly dirty back then, but it's okay now obviously. Bio broly could have been way cooler. Eggman. Oh from Sonic? Sure, why not? <laughs> Yo, Zordon. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> Zordon, yo, that that's actually hilarious. Like if I could if I could ever have one messy ass crossover between Dragon Ball and Power Rangers, because let's face it, I mean, sure it might work considering that Dragon Ball can get pretty goofy. I mean, they've they've had like the Pride Troopers and the Ginyu Force and Great Saiyan and stuff like that, which are very Sentai themed, which is obviously where Power Rangers comes from. So the idea of having Power Rangers mixed in with Dragon Ball isn't totally out of the realm of like i can't imagine it right so is this saying sort of <laughs> that's just actually a really good one that's that. That, that that this one this one might take the cake monster carrot reborn what <laughs> baby or janemba hmm that would be interesting so some of these answers right like when when you guys tell me like you know actual characters that i can almost see be put into a situation very closely because again like baby is like a, a tuffle but the way he looks is like his design is very experimental looking and janemba is a, essentially is the embodiment of pure evil in a body essentially right so yeah i mean in the future i could definitely see something like that happen i definitely would love to see janemba be brought into the you know main canonical story but nice shadow oh from sonic okay so there's two sonic answers in this video that's freaking hilarious last but not least Barney! <laughs> <laughs> That'd be way too funny. Just freaking, it's like, oh, they're freaking, it's like the sirens are going off and everyone's freaking out. Like, oh my God, he's emerging and it's freaking... I hate kids. Hilarious. So those were all the responses for this video um, off of this community post. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know if I should do more of this type of content because again like i figured i would try to do something a little bit different for youtube in the similar light that i normally would do this live on my twitch channel obviously quick plug so go follow me on twitch link in the description below i love having direct interaction with you guys the audience my fans and the supporters and whatnot and i figured having this kind of discussion or video whatever would be fun so hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you want to see more let me know and join my discord so that you can give me direct ideas because i'm obviously looking at comments but sometimes you know i might miss some so either way guys let me know what you thought make sure you guys are leaving a like share the video leave a comment as well and subscribe if you haven't and hit the bell for all the notifications for this the future updates and videos to this channel and make sure y'all are taking care of yourselves may the power protect you keep it locked loaded right here on this channel stay safe stay clean stay inside i'll see y'all next time